morning, class. Good morning, sir. You may take your seat. Um, Julie Beth and Lily, the play prayer. So, who is absent today, class? None, sir. Wow, that's nice to hear, Kitita. So, last meeting, we are done with our topic, um, nail care materials and equipment. So, what again is the definition of materials? Anyone from the class? Yes, Julie Beth? Sir, materials are consumable. Exactly, very good. So, kindly give one example of materials. Yes. Pusher. So... What is this a pusher? A pusher. So can you give me one example of materials, Micheline? Sir, this is to sanitize and clean buildings. Very good. So class, before we move to our next lesson, um, I have here sets of pictures that uh, you are going to see, okay? So look carefully. Um, what are the tools present on the pictures? Any idea? Yes, Micheline? Sir, nail brush or wood stick nail cutter than me. Very good. So, what else? Any idea? Yes, do you remember? Very good. So, uh, why is it important to know the correct uh, ways on how each of the nail care tools and equipment in each nail care service is done? So, why is it important? Yes, Billy Beth? So, it is a very important to know their co correct ways because it is serves as a guide to do a certain task. Exactly. So, in addition, uh, knowing the correct ways or, or uses of nail care tools and equipment is important to avoid injuries. Avoid injuries in a way that you know which of the tools are sharp, like the edge of the nail paper or the nail pusher. Yeah, um, that may cause you wounds if not handled or used well. So, from the pictures I've shown you and from the questions I've asked you, what do you think is our lesson for today? Anyone from the class? What do you think is our lesson for today from the pictures I've shown you and from the questions I've asked you? Anyone? Do you have any idea, class? Yes. You're saying something, Micheline. Serious nature. Very good, exactly. So, our topic for today is all about use nail care tools. So last meeting, I told you to bring your tools. Now, do you have your tools? Yes. Where are your tools? Okay. So moving on, kindly read. Jolly Bell. Thank you. Once considered as luxury for few or as a mark of this tension between the rich and the poor. It is now within the reach of the general public. In fact, part of a person doing and a form of unexpensive relaxation is a regular nature activity, be it manicure, pedicure, and spa or food spa. Okay, thank you, gentlemen. So, Nail care once considered as a luxury for the few or as a mark of distinction between the rich and the poor. The, take note of this. Um, it, it is a mark of distinction between the rich and the poor. So, kapag noon, kapag, nag, may, kapag nagpalinis ka ng kuko, ang mayaman ka na. Ngayon, 
In fact, part of the person's grooming in a form of inexpensive relaxation is a regular nail care activity. So, ngayon, um, kahit sino pwede nang magpalinis ng kuko, di ba? Right? Yes. Okay, so... The following shows the use and proper way of holding some nail, nail care tools or implements. So first one we have, what's this? What's the name of this material or tool? This is a emery board. So kindly read Micheline. Emery board, it is a held in the same manners as the nail file, the, the rough surface of the nail using the fine side to smoothen. If any work are discarded after using one first. Thank you, Miss Eileen. So, a emery board, what, where, where are your emery boards? Sir. Did you bring with you? Okay. So, emery board is a cardboard with a powdered emery, um, a material, our substance capable of yes. So where are your emery boards? Okay, so it says here that emery boards are discarded after use on one person. So why 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 do you think any idea why it is being discarded after use on one person? Because emery board is made out of paper. Made out of paper hindi siya pwedeng sanitize kaya after use on one person, itatapon na. Hindi na siya pwedeng ihugi. Okay? Did yes. you understand? So, here is the steps on how to use emery board. So, hold your emery board then. Hold emery board between thumb and index. Okay? Between thumb and index. Like this. Thumb and index, finger of the dominant hand. Kung saan kayo sanay humawa. Left hand or left hand ba? Ay, right hand kayo. Right. Okay. So, number two, kindly read. Jolly Beth. Hold the client's finger between thumb and index finger or auxiliary hand. Okay. So, assuming that you have a client. Now, it says there that you will hold the fingertip between the thumb and index like this, okay? So next, position the emery board under the free edge of the nail. You position here because this is your free edge, okay? Yes. Now, next, slide emery board across free edge to the center of the nail edge in one stroke. So, kind of slide. Emery board across the edge to the center, like this, in. Do it, come on. Work from the corner to the center of the nail, okay? Yes. Next one, place the emery board on the opposite side of the nail and repeat procedure. So, kapag natapos ka sa kabila, pupunta ka naman sa kabila to para mapantay, okay? Yes, sir. Did you understand? Yes, sir. Repeat until desired shape is achieved. Okay. And last, check nail aid, nail edge for rough, rough spots. Bevel nail by lightly filing edge downward with the fine side of the emery board. So, did you understand the use and proper way of holding the emery board, class? Yes, sir. Okay. So, moving on, we have, what's that? Any guess? Nail file. Very good, Jolly Bet. So, nail file. And the read, Micheline? Nail file. Hold the file firmly in the right or left hand, as the base may be, with the thumb underneath it for support and the other for finger on the upper surface. Place, place the file slide under the frame and turn the nail from corner to center using the nail. Okay, so where is your nail file? Okay, so never file back and forth. Um, it means, uh, yung yung iba kasi kapag nag-nail file sila, binabalik, di ba? Na-observe nyo ba yan kapag nagpapalinis kayo ng kuko? Yes. Binabalik na ganun. So never nail file back and forth. Why? 
this would cause um, the nails to crack and split. Do not file also deep into the corners because this weakens the nails. Did you understand? Yes, sir. It can also hurt the skin and cause ingrown nails. You, you remember that class, okay? So, here is the steps on how to proper hold and yes, the nail file. It is same with the emery board. So, can you read the number one? Hold nail file between thumb and index finger of the knee. Just like the emery board, hold the nail file between thumb and index, okay? So, Hold the client's fingertip between thumb and index finger for seven hand, blah blah blah, and so on. Okay, so what do you think is the difference of emery board and nail file? Emery board is made out of paper and is discarded after use on one person, while nail file you can use multiple because. Pwede siyang i-sterilize, okay? So, remember that class, okay? Yes, sir. You understand? Yes, sir. Okay? Next one, we have, what's that? Brush. Very good, Micheline. So, the function of brush is to, and we read, Jolly Beth. Nail brush. Insert the ring finger and pinky in the nail brush. Handle and brush the nail with a downward motion from the base of the fingertips to clean the nail in fingers. So, did you bring with you your nail brush? Yes, sir. Okay, very good. So, where is your pinky finger? Do you know where your pinky finger is located? No. You don't know your pinky finger? This is your pinky finger, okay? The smallest finger on your hands. So insert the ring finger and the pinky finger in the nail brush. So do it, class. And with a downward mo motion from the base of the fingertips, clean the fingernails. Yes, like this, okay? Yes. Did you understand? Yes, sir. Okay, so moving on, we have... Orange wood stick. Very good. So, orange wood stick is, kindly read. Anyone from the class? Okay, go on, Michelle. Orange wood stick, it is held in the same manner as in writing, make a pencil. To do some critical work around paint for applying oil or solvents like with the cotton written, orange wood stick can work around the base of the nail. So, where is your orange wood stick? Sure. Very good. So, it is held in the same manner as writing. Paano kayo humawak ng ball pen? Can you show me how? Okay, very good. So, to loosen cuticle, work around the nail. Do it like this. Yes. Okay, for applying or, or for, it is also used for applying oil or solvents like the dip, the cotton, the orange will stick and work around the base of the nail. It is... Also used to clean under the free edge. Yung mga dumi sa ilalim ng ating kuko. Yes. Oh, remember that class, okay? Yes. So, here is the step on how to use orange wood stick. Kindly read. Anyone? Go, Julie Beth. Hold orange wood stick. 2.5 cm from feet. Okay. Now you hold your orange wood stick. Starting at one side of the nail, gently begin to loosen the cuticle yes. with a rotating action. Like that. Work from one side of the nail to the other. Using tip of the implement, remove matter from under the free edge. Under the free edge and Using a cotton, carefully mold back skin or wipe, wiping off remaining cuticle remover. So, let's move on to the next. What is that? You have any idea? No. What tool is that? That is a cuticle nail pusher. So, kindly read Micheline. Cuticle nail pusher. It is 
held in the same manner as in writing with a pencil. The down tape side is used to burn back and will send the cuticles. Keep critical noise in between critical and over while working. Use the critical pusher in a class position to remove the death critical advert. Hearing to the main without scraping, scratching the nail. Okay, take, take note without <coughs> scratching the nail blade. Okay? Yes. So, here is the steps on how to use a nail pusher. So, where is your nail pushers? Okay, so apply cuticle remover to cuticle in one stroke, spread it with a brush. Okay? To, um, allow to stand for one minute, then hold cuticle nail pusher 2.5 cm from tip and starting at one side, just like the orange wood stick, gently begin to loosen the cuticle with a rotating action from one side to another. Okay, did you understand? Yes, sir. Now, using the tip of the implement, remove matter from the free edge. Okay. So, hindi lang siya ginagamit to loosen the cuticle. Pwede rin siya gamitin to para kang tanggal ng mga dumi sa ating free edge. Okay? So, using a cotton, carefully mold back skin, wiping off the remaining cuticle remover. Okay? Moving on, we have also, what's that? Very good. It is a cuticle nipper. Who wants to read? Yes. Very good. Cut the cuticle nipper by the handles and turn the cutting edge towards you. Place the bent tip of the index finger over the top of the shaft. Place the thumb on the side of the handle and the remaining fingers over the opposite handle. Okay, so where is your nail cuticle nipper? Okay. So one, adjust clipper in working position. Two, uh, turn client's palm up. Three, uh, hold client's finger upright between your thumb and fingers. You hold this like this, okay? The fingers of your clients. Kindly do it to Micheline. Uh, hold clippers with cutting edges downward between the thumb and index. You hold it like this, okay? Now, place the nail plate between cutting edges, holding clipper to cut straight across the nail plate. So, if you hold like this, then place the nail plate between cutting edges, holding clipper to cut straight across the nail plate. So, ganito lang siya kapag. Okay? Next, um, gauge the desired length of the nail, not shorter than 3 millimeters, and press clipper handles by squeezing handles together and Remove excess length. So, did you understand the use of nail cut I, cuticle nipper? Yes, sir. Okay. So, moving on, we also have nail cutter. Very good. So, nail cutter, hold clippers with cutting edges downward between thumb, index, and middle finger. Press clipper handles by squeezing them together and remove excess Nail length. So, to use nail cutter, we have prepared the types of instruments for this task. So, we have nail cutter. Are you you're still listening, class? Before using your nail cutter, make sure that it is clean. Kindly see your nail cutter if it's clean. Yes, sir. Okay. So, you must cut your nails in a place where you can clearly see what you are doing. Siyempre, kaya sinasabi ng matatanda na hindi tayo pwede magpukos sa gabi dahil hindi natin nakikita. So, yun yung purpose niya. Okay? Decide the shape of your nails. So, it is important to decide the shape of your nails before cutting. Para pare-pareha sila ng shapes. Very good. Start cutting your nails starting from your little finger. Your pinky finger. You still remember? Okay. Dapat dito tayo magsisimula, papa, papunta sa ating thumb. Okay, we remember that. Click the nail cutter that can cut through the nail. After cutting your nails, use a nail file or a nail board to smooth and rough and odd surface of newly trimmed nails. So, 
Do you understand the use of nail cutter? Yes, sir. So keep in mind, um, learning to use tools and equipment properly assures you that you will give your client nail care service safely. You should carefully follow these tips if you want to achieve quality service all the time. Okay? Yes. So that's so that concludes our lesson for today. Um, do you have any question, class? No, sir. Okay, if not, let's have an activity. So for your activity, um, um I, I, I want you to choose three nail, nail care tools and demonstrate it in class. So, here is the rubric for your activity. Um, I will give you five minutes to do, to finish your activity. Um, who wants to go first? You will just choose three nail care tools, then you demonstrate it in class. Okay? So, Julie Beth, come on. So what what tools did you choose? Nyata, ano yung mga tools na hawak mo anak ko? Okay, so we have the nail, the cuticle nipper, okay? Okay, so what you will do is to read the following, then show it to class, demonstrate it in class, okay? Okay, adjust the clipper in working position. Clipper, clipper. Turn client's palm up. I will be your client, okay? So hold client's finger upright between your thumb and fingers, okay? So hold clippers with cutting edges downward between the thumb and index. Place nail plate between cutting edges. Hold clipper to straight across nail plate. And now watch the desired length of nail up shorter than 3 mm. Then press clipper handles by squeezing handles. Okay. So, yeah. Okay, so thank you, Johnny Beck. You may take your seat. So, uh, um, so why should filing be done from the corners to the centers of our nails? Okay, you depend on us. Sir, to avoid cracking and splitting of the nails. Very good. So, ask not to endure the live tissues of our nails. Okay? Yes. Okay, so, um, what is the difference of orange wood stick and uh, nail pusher? Go, Michelle. So, orange wood stick is used for applying or for to them above the nails white nail to where it is used for coating the or to send the wood. Very good. So, why is it important to know the correct ways on how each of the nail care tools um, and equipment in each nail care service is done? Go, Julie Best. So, it is very important to know the correct way to way because it serves us as a guide to do a center task. Well Sir, said, Julie Beth. So, um, let's see how much you've learned by answering the five questions here. So, kindly bring out one for sheet of paper. Read the statement carefully and write T if the statement is true and F is the statement is false. So, I will give you three minutes to do the exercise, okay? Yes. Sir. 
Okay, so are you done class? Yes. Yes, sir. Okay, so number one, what is your answer? True. Very good. How about number two? True. True. Okay, good. Three is false. How about number four? True. And number five, lastly? False. Okay, so who got perfect score? Okay, so very good. So for your assignment, search and make an advanced reading on how to properly sanitize and sterilize tools and equipment used in the field. Write it in your notebook. So that will be all for today, class. Goodbye. Goodbye, sir. Stop.